Zach, thanks for sitting down with me today. How are you doing so far? Doing pretty good. It's been a busy week, but I've enjoyed it. What have you, what have you been up to this week? Uh, just selling paper, you know. I, I started working for FedEx and doing supplies and shipping and all that kind of thing lately. Okay. You got any yeah. big plans coming up this weekend? Uh, I'm going to go on vacation with my wife and kids. We're actually going to Disney World. They've never been. Oh, cool. How long are you going to be there for? Uh, I think we leave on Friday night and we get back Tuesday night, so mm-hmm. like four days or so. Just make sure you bring a lot of sunscreen because it is hot in Florida, especially in August. I, I'm from there, so I just take my advice. Just <laughs> yeah, did, yeah, I've heard uh, I've heard some horror stories, and I want to be mm-hmm. pale complexion. You know, I want to avoid those. That can be pretty bad sometimes. Mm-hmm. Are you meeting anybody there? Or it's just family trip, or uh, no? Kids are out of school. Feared I'd take them on vacation since they've never been there. Have some fun for the weekend. Cool, cool. Any other big plans outside of that? Uh, I have a big work meeting Thursday before I go to out of town on Friday, but out of that, no real plans. Okay, cool, cool. Well, Zach, uh, like I said, I really appreciate you sitting down with us today. Um, with just three things we're gonna go over. Uh, first, why I chose the financial services industry, what AXA is, and how they serve their clients. Uh, what in particular did you want me um, to hit on in this conversation? Uh, it doesn't have to be immediately, but I'd like to hit on, like, I want to retire by the time I'm 60. So, okay. so I plan to get towards that. Yeah, I'll definitely hit on that when we get there. So why I chose the industry. Um, I've been familiar with finance for since I was born. My dad, he worked in property tax for Fidelity for about 40 years before he retired. So I knew what it meant to have money put away and to have it saved for rainy days or emergencies. And we all like to think that we're prepared for anything, but you know, life likes to throw curveballs at you. Mm-hmm. Uh, my freshman year of high school, my mom was diagnosed with pancreatic cancer. That, on top of my dad moving his parents from Arizona to Texas the year before, really added a bunch of stress onto our family and really stretched us pretty thin. But you know, my dad, he was a trooper. He went to work, he did his job, and he came home, he was there for us, he was there, especially for my mom. But over the course of the next two years, she did end up losing her battle. And we also lost my grandparents along the way. Uh, my mom and my dad's mom within about six months of each other. Um, I remember being woken up at three o'clock in the morning by my dad telling me to go wake up my uncle to tell him the tell him the news that she had passed. And it was definitely uh, probably the lowest point in our family's history, but we, we bounced back. We found strength and love in our friends and our family and our community. And it really opened my eyes to what I wanted to do with my career. I, uh, it really, to just have one less thing to worry about and to be completely focused on the people that really need it. And I've always wanted to help people. I try to go out of my way to make sure someone has a better day or just better time in general, whether it's in this capacity or just if they're having a bad day, just trying to get them to crack a smile. That means the world to me. And so while I was studying at Tech, I, uh, at Texas Tech, I found that the financial services industry was a perfect blend of what I experienced and what I'm passionate about. And while I was looking at uh, careers to look into or firms to work at, I ran into an old friend of mine, uh, Ben. Um, he works here in the office as well. And he was telling me about accident. and I was really interested in seeing what, what they had to offer. Um, I'm pretty, pretty strict about what I want out of a company, what the environment that I want to be in. And when I got to the office, I saw it was, it was exactly where I should be. Uh, the, the people that work here, they're strong-minded, they're strong-willed, they, they're competitive, they're not competitors, they're teammates, they, they pick each other up, not put each other down, and they really treat their clients as, as people, not as numbers on a page or dollars in their bank account. And I really feel like I could make a, a career for myself here and see myself growing here long term. So uh, what did you know about AXA before I reached out to you? Well, I didn't know that much before, but thanks for sharing that with me. No problem.